All right, this is attempted radio repair time. <laughs> I don't know if I'll be able to fix this thing. Um, so I was at uh, Anchor Electronics and the lady gave me this radio. I, I, it's probably radio they use in the back room to make, to make music. Um, but it's, uh, it's a Sony and uh, let's see, what's the model number? It is a TFM. 7350W, 13 transistors, plus one transistor for aux circuit, uh, plus one LED. Uh, it's got a wide band FM, one, uh, 161 to 163 megahertz, FM 87.5 to 105 megahertz, AM, uh, it's got an internal IF of 10.7 megahertz and an AM IF of 455 kilohertz. So um, uses four standard C batteries or four watts of 120. Um, so uh, let's go ahead and turn it on. I can show you what it uh, what its problem is. Let's see here. I get the cord untangled. All right, power on, and you hear, bow. No matter what you do it. And volume doesn't make it go louder. That's interesting. Tone doesn't, that tone makes it sound a little bit different. Oh, yeah. yeah. So I assume that it's just 60 hertz hum from a bad capacitor, but that's just a guess. Um, let's see here. I could put a bunch of batteries in it and see if it quiets down. That would be interesting. I don't think I have enough batteries though. I don't think, think I have any. What's it take? D cells? C cells? C cells, right? Uh, I don't think I have any. Um, all right, I say we open it up, take a look inside. See if I can get these screws out. Oh, they're really long ones. That doesn't work out. Oh, it does. Okay. Is that enough? Knob on the back. There's a hidden screw somewhere. See, is this a screw? Yeah, it's a screw right there. It was actually hidden 
hidden by a spider nest, believe it or not. A little film of something over there was a little spider's nest. All right, now, there we go. It's coming apart. All right, uh, let's see here. Battery connection there. Where's the other battery connection? Oh, here. All right, so we can put could put DC volts from here to here and uh, see if it works. Looks like uh, looks like Sony. They were not into making things look pretty, but making things look functional. Um, very interesting. Big speaker, really big speaker. Oh, what's this? Something funny going on there. Huh, what is that? Oh, there's a little clip on the radio. Oh, look at that. They, a little clip onto the, uh, onto the speaker coil just as an AC ground, they put a capacitor on there to uh, ground that out. That's interesting. Uh, let's see here. I don't see how this is held in. Huh. Maybe it all just comes out. I don't know. Maybe just the knobs in the front are holding. Seems like the case is pushing on the PC board. And just the, uh, maybe just the knobs on the front are keeping it in. Interesting. Do I even need to take it out? Maybe not. Yep, oh, yep, there we go. Knob came off. Take these knobs off. All right. There's a radio. Goodness. Um, wow. There are a bunch of really old capacitors. Three, four, five, six, seven. Here's the output transformer for the speaker. Minus, plus, all right. So I say, let's see, four times uh, one and a half, three, that's six volts. Um, yeah, let's put six volts on it. See if it, see if it works. something. Hmm. 
Well, it doesn't go which is good. Let's see, how do I operate this thing? Uh, AM is over here. Inland, oh, there we go. Well, that's good. We have a working radio, but the AC section doesn't work. A little LED here, that's kind of cool. It tells you when you're... All right, so we can disconnect that. And take a look over here on the AC section. Uh, let's see. Power cord comes in here. Move you over. This is the power cord, goes into the little transformer. Looks like there's a bridge rectifier there, or a transistor. Oh, that looks like a transistor. Huh, interesting. It goes in there. And we've got to figure out where... where the AC goes. I don't know, there's a... That's really the only big cap in the area, unless there's something under the, under the, oh, there we go. There's a big capacitor right there. Ah, that's probably the one right there. And here's a, uh, here's the diode. All right, so I think we need to get under there. Hmm, all right. Hmm. This might be tricky. I need to get the uh, dial off the front without breaking it. Yeah, without breaking it. Oh dear. Yeah, I gotta. I gotta remember how to put the string back on in case it comes off. Let me take some pictures. Wound down there. And it's wound over here. And... Goes in the middle there. It's kind of a weird little, little weird little thing in the middle. Take a picture. Take a picture. All right. I need to get this thing out of there, though. This is attached there too. Oh goodness. Oh goodness. This does not come apart easily. Not at all. Uh. So I think I will just try to work on it from this angle. There's a big capacitor right there I want to get out of there. So heat up my soldering iron. Oh, goodness.
not easy to grab. There we go. Oh yeah, that one's dead. That one's dead. Okay. What is he? A thousand microfarads at 10 volts. All right. Thousand microfarads. Okay, well, let me go look for one. Oh, this is going to be hard to do because my legs are short. My legs are short. I think I need long legs. Let's take our little short leaded capacitor and put some long legs on him. Uh, then I probably solder from this side. They're going to fall off. Ah. Uh, All right, this won't be fine. Okay, much better. Much, much better. Now they're too long. <laughs> now they're too long. That's okay. All right. Much better. Okay, got one through. Now, can I get the other one through? There we go. Ah, good. All right. There we go. Let's see here. So. All right. So, should we plug it in, see if it works? Make sure we're not shorting anything out. Okay, uh, so it's working with the battery. I've replaced the capacitor. And so it's now working. If I plug it in, will it continue to work? There we go. Later in his trip, Next. His ability to see and spit on things. I, did he have that rare ability? Awesome. I mean, the ball to go a lot further. He's so much bigger. All of a sudden, he was a middle linebacker, not a safety. But he, it was his eyesight and everything that. All right. Let's put it back together and give it back.
let's see, how did this go in there? Like that? And this one in here, like, like what? Not like that. Must have been in like that. Okay. Like that. to play the Los Angeles Angels. They didn't ex exist back then. You know, we got to go on a five-hour flight. All right, there we go, complete. Does FM work? Maybe. Yep, FM works, AM works.
The switch is a bit funny on the AM. All right, there we go. That was a quick one, but uh, easy fix.